So is it quiet in the rest of the part of the house? Because it's not going to be quiet here. It's time for board math, you guys. Let's get at it. All together, loud and proud with B-O-A-R-D. B-O-A-R-D. Board math, board math. Yippee. Read along with me. What number is it? 93. How do we write a 93? A 9 for the tens, a 3 for the ones. 93. What number comes next? 43, 44, 45. A 4 for the tens, a 5 for the ones. 45. 60, 70, 80. 8 for the tens, a 0 for the ones. 80. How many do you see? Well, they're sort of in a zigzag pattern. Let's go ahead and count those down. Here we go with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. How do we write an 11? A 1 for the tens, a 1 for the ones, 11. Is it greater than, less than, or equal? Okay, so let's get our number here first. Remember, these are tally marks, and when we've got that connector, that means they're five. So we can count by fives here. Five, 10, and then count on 11, 12. Write a 12 with a one for the 10, there's our tens, and two ones. And now we have our two numbers. Are they equal? No, they're not. They both have one 10, but this has two ones, and this one has three ones. So which one is the bigger number, the greater number? 13 is, and let's read it. 12 is less than 13. Number sentences, going down, here we go. Five plus five equals mental math, fingers, or our pictures. Start with our five, one, two, three, four, five. Plus means bring in more. How many more? Five more. One, two, three, four, five. How many all together? Well, that's a 10 frame right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Going down, we're gonna put our zero in the ones here and then our one for our 10 next to it. Five plus five equals 10. Nine plus one equals. Mental math, fingers, or pictures. Start with our nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Plus, bring in more. How many? One more. There's that 10 frame again. It's already full. So we got nine plus one. Put our zero for our ones here. Put our one right next to it for our 10. Nine plus one equals. 10. Seven plus three equals mental math, fingers, or pictures. Start with our seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Plus means to bring in more. How many more? Three more. One, two, three. Again, look at that. It goes into our 10 frame, 10 of them. So, straight down, we're gonna put our zero for our ones here, our one for our 10 next to it. Seven plus three equals 10. How many in the 10 frames? Okay, here's our two 10 frames. First one's full, that's 10. Second one's not full, it has one, two, three, four, five in it. 10 and five more is? 15, one of our teen numbers. 15 are in there. How many more to make 20? 20 is two full tens, so we gotta finish filling it up. One, two, three, four, five. We need five more to make 20. Five. What shape is it? Okay, it's made from other shapes, but what shape is that? That's a 
hexagon. It's made with a rectangle in the middle and two triangles on the side, but if we just get rid of those lines, we can see that hexagon, okay? How do you know? Well, it's flat. It's two-dimensional or 2D. It has one, two, three, four, five, six vertices or corners. And it has one, two, three, four, five, six sides. Six sides. That's what makes it a hexagon. What shapes do you see? We're back in that forest, okay? Taking a look. We can see the photos have been made with circles. Here's a square or rectangle. It looks almost like a square picture. But taking a look at the animals. Right here, the rabbit's ear, and the fox's ear if you can see it, and the deer's ear. What shape did they look like? They look like triangles. Even the rabbit's little nose looks like a triangle there. What about their eyes? What would their eyes be? Well, we call them a lot of the times eyeballs. So those eyes would be spheres. Okay, good job, you guys. Word problem. Abigail has two chocolate kisses. Abriel has two more chocolate kisses than Abigail. How many chocolate kisses does Abriel have? Okay, do your mental math, but let's get our information here. Abigail has two chocolate kisses. Abriel has two more chocolate kisses than Abigail. How many chocolate kisses does Abriel have? Okay. Let's think about it. We've been working on this one this week. More than. Okay, that means adding. But how do we do it? Let's start off with Abigail here. Okay. We're going to use her name. Abby, that's her nickname. She has two chocolate kisses. Okay. One. Two. Well, Abriel, okay, so Abriel, so I'm just going to do A, B, sorry, Abriel. But Abriel has two more chocolate kisses than Abigail. So she has to have the two kisses that Abigail has, but she has two more than that. She has two more than what Abby has. Okay, one, two. How many chocolate kisses does Abriel have? One, two, three, four because she has the two that Abby has plus two more than her, which equals four chocolate kisses. Mmm, yummy. Make sure you guys are sharing with your family, girls. Okay, did it all make sense? I hope so. Amazing job, you guys. I think I'm gonna have to invest in some earplugs. Great job, it's loud and proud. You guys are doing amazing. See you later.